Hey everyone, I just wanted to share a quick tip about using camera markers in Blender for an animation. Animation will be perfect only if we present the animation in an appealing manner by using proper camera angles. Each scene in an animation is uh, divided into different shots. This particular tip I found while we are working in Project Angelo. So let's look what it is. Uh, Blender is having the functionality of creating markers for a camera and binding it into that so that we can switch over the camera whenever we need in a timeline. Let's look how we can work out that one. This is a shot what we are having now and we have two cameras in the scene. The first camera is having action something like this and I just want to switch over the camera in between in the middle of this animation to a long shot okay so how do we do that now let's hold on to this and we can fix a camera marker in the timeline we we should have our cursor in the timeline and we can press m at any frame now i'm in the frame number one i'm going to fix m so i have already created a marker over here and we we can type control v in the timeline to bind the camera to the marker we should ensure that we have selected the correct camera so come back to the timeline and we can press ctrl b and this camera is now bound to the first marker and in the midway somewhere by frame number 80 something like that i just want to switch over to this camera which is the long shot I have already set it up for you now I have to create another marker there is another way of creating the marker we can just go to marker and we can add marker and we can also bind the camera using the menu we can go to view and ensure that camera is selected just click bind camera to markers so now in the first frame we will be having the first camera and after the 80th frame we can just look at how it has been switched off to another camera this feature is very useful while we have our animation a single animation and which has to be represented by lot of pulling shots like close up to wide shot wide to close up or else uh, some other camera angle which will represent our animation in an appealing manner 